Hey, good afternoon, everyone. Just wanted to leave a brief word of encouragement to somebody today. I want to say to you that if you have somehow messed up, because we all do, you know, if you've fallen, if you have made a wrong decision, you've connected with the wrong person, you know, sometimes we're just flat out disobedient, right? Don't get stuck there. Get up, dust off. Uh, repent before God and then let's keep that thing moving right you know oftentimes when we are uh, we've come out of position we are no longer in alignment the enemy um, will come in with condemnation and we need to understand that's very different from what God does God comes in the Holy Spirit comes in and he convicts us conviction is for the purpose of correction conviction is for the purpose of saying hey and you know you're going in the wrong direction. Uh, you you had the wrong attitude. You know you need an attitude adjustment. You you need to listen to what I'm saying. You're you're doing your own thing. Um, that was not the right person I told you to connect with. Um, whatever it is, that is healthy conviction for the purpose of correction. So it's like we've gotten off track, and the Holy Spirit comes in with conviction. But then the enemy always wants to join the party right so he comes in with condemnation again that's different because conviction is to draw us closer to God condemnation is to cause us to grow away from God and so with condemnation there's always feelings of guilt and shame and even unforgiveness of ourselves because now we can turn what was his condemnation into self-condemnation and now he doesn't even have to mess with us because we are keeping our own self bound I want to speak to somebody today that you are allowing self-condemnation to keep you stuck where you are it is time beloved to release yourself you repented before God God forgave you he threw that thing as far as the east is from the west it's time for you you to release it is time for you to let yourself go set yourself free you've been holding yourself a prisoner for too long that thing that you did two years ago two weeks ago two hours ago right it's time to move forward so I just wanted to encourage somebody today know the difference between conviction and condemnation um, you know the Bible tells us that there is therefore no condemnation for those who are in Christ and are you in Christ I know you are I'm in Christ and so I daily try not to pick up uh, condemnation and you know hold myself captive where God has set me free amen the Bible tells us that who Whosoever is free in Christ is free indeed. I'm free, you're free. Walk in that freedom today. And the first act of freedom that you're going to do is to allow yourself to move past that mistake that you have been, you know, keeping, um, keeping over your own head for, for a long time. I pray this blesses and encourages somebody today. It's time to dust off, uh, get up, and keep it moving. Have a blessed day, you guys. Talk to you later. Love you.